Hey friends. Well, all of a sudden, I got a lot of people watching me. And people think I'm really young. 25, 26, 27. Which is really cool. But I'm almost 38 years old. So when people find that out, they start asking me questions like, Molly Ann, what are you doing? How do you not have as many wrinkles as the rest of us? Well, I do. I mean, you'll see that. I got one for each of my five children burned in their fraternity. But there are some things you can do. Today I'm going to show you my favorite beauty tip, which y'all know I love you if I'm sharing this with you, because this has been passed down for generations in my family. You're going to need a hat first. I love this hat. That's my favorite color. Put your hat on. Tuck all your hair up inside it. Just like that. All right. What a lot of people don't know is we have tiny muscles all over our face. And we'll work out our, our whole bodies and forget to work these muscles out. But sometimes, you just got too much to do. Now, if you work from home, this is great. You can do it all day sitting in front of your computer. Nobody's going to see. It's great. So, the first muscle we're going to start with is the forehead. The forehead starts to get real grouchy, just like this. But we want a forehead to come up just like this. So, you got your hat. The next thing you're going to need is some tape. All right, you take your tape. You start at the back of your hat. Sometimes I need an extra hand for this. Just pull that forehead up as high as you can. Just like that. Now, we're going to go around one more time. And this time we're going to pull the eyebrows up because we all want to move our eyebrows. Nice and high, nice bright eyes. Just like this. Pull up that eyebrow up. Go across the mouth and get your other one. There you go. I feel more awake already. Now, another thing that happens is our noses start to get really long. They start to sag a little bit. So, we want to take a piece of tape. You're going to start at the tip of your nose. Don't block your air passage. You need that. And you're just going to... Don't pull too hard in. Pull it up just a little bit. This will help give you that nice, young, perky nose that we all try to hang on to. I mean, women pay thousands of dollars for this. And you can spend just a dollar on some tape and get the same effect. The next thing is our cheeks. They like to get really hollow and saggy as we get older. We want those nice, young, plump cheeks coming up just like this. So we're going to start on the back of the hat. You're going to come around. You want to get right under that cheek. Lift it up high as you can. There it goes. Come around here this way. Same thing. There it goes. Nice high cheeks. Now that is not what I wanted to happen with my nose. I want it straight and pretty. Not crooked. There we go. Oh, my lip. Nobody wants flat lips, y'all. So pull those lips out. Now the next one is for our chin. We don't want to get the, the saggy chin thing happening. So just start at the top. We're going to go under here. Don't do this too tight because you can strangle yourself. If it's really bad, let's go around one more time. It's okay. Hey, that was a little too tight. There we go. And if you don't have to talk to anybody for a little while, you can also do the one that will help pout your lips out. So, you just pat your lips up as far as you can. And you're going to tape around the outside. Catch this tape up here that you got for your cheeks. Just like that. Now, the great thing about this one, it builds the muscles in your lips, so no more of them make up lines when you put on your lipstick. I hope y'all enjoy Molly and beauty tips today. And I'll have more for you coming real soon. Just keeping it real, y'all. Peace.